Oh, it's this guy. Who is this guy? It's the item merchant. <gasps> Keep gasping. Everything is surprising. Is he going to be a boss? He's, He's talking as if the rebellion is over. So I think my forward in time situation, my forward in time theory still has some meat to it. Who's, who's Tenor? Tenor is the name of the guy who conducts the... He, he does the singing. Yeah, but like in the game, who is yeah. he? Uh, don't know. It probably notes his rank in some way. Do you want to buy our shitty photos? <laughs> yeah. I would be able to sit down. Is that a dead ostrich? Mm, I have no idea what that is. Pack? What is that? Shop. Let's see. Nice. These are all ranked pieces. This is the same photo three times. Oh, <laughs> I need to remind you these were my pictures. Yeah. Look, and it's the same photo three times. Yeah. You just you get twenty. You go into battle, take photos. You just get twenty thousand gold every time you hit the A button. You can just take several pictures. Yeah, it's great. Yeah. That's yeah. fantastic. Wow, we're rich. New weapon for Polka again, even though we're not going to equip Has every single shopkeeper just had an upgraded weapon? Absorb 10% of inflicted damage as HP, Jesus Christ. Has every single shopkeeper just had an upgraded weapon for each character every single time? Yeah, basically. Oh, this okay. is a Norse mythology thing, by the way. Oh, mis mistletoe? Oh, yeah. it's a mistletoe sword. Yeah, it's it's because the, the like Norse pr word for mistletoe is mistletain. Yeah. And the thing about it was... Um, yeah, they threw a dart in Baldur's eye. No, like they, his mom was, Baldur was afraid he was going to die because of, um, Muspelheim is also a Norse mythology thing. I think all these weapons might be. No, no. I know the story you're talking about. Yeah. But you probably should tell the audience. It's not yeah. me you're telling it to, really. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Hey, go on, go tell it, tell the story. So Baldur, there was like a prophecy that he was going to die. But he was, so his mom was like, oh, we can't have that. So his mom decided, not just bloody no thanks. So his mom decided to call literally everything, like every creature on the, and thing, and plant on the planet and say, hey, can you please not kill my son? And they were like, oh, okay, I guess we won't. But she forgot to call the mistletoe because it was small and soft and no one really, no one was really, she didn't consider that it might be used as a weapon. And so, so because everything had promised not to kill Baldur, people made a sport of, um, of like throwing shit at him and like shooting arrows at him because every time it got close to him, it would just dodge out of the way because it had promised not to kill him. But then Loki, he got jealous. He was like, well, I'm not standing for this. So he made, like, an arrow out of mistletoe, and he gave it to a blind guy who had always wanted to be part of the throwing shit at Baldur, like, club. Can I just predict that it's slightly foreshadowing that one of the main characters has been given a weapon that is responsible for starting Ragnarok? It's a good point. I'm just gonna... I don't know. I, don't, I have no idea. Frederick has been a complete. Can you look up in the manual? The manuals here. Can you look up what air body body does? It's like you could just go to the page that talks about battle mechanics and um. Sure. Like, lead forward a bit. I'll just Google it. No, because it says in the manual. There's an eternal sonata wiki, so I might as well use it. All right. Air body character special attacks are not affected by the shadow generated by an opponent, and the character mm. does not cast a shadow. Which is useful, so the enemy doesn't get in our shadow. I guess. No, I guess I guess we can keep it then, because like some of the armor yeah. that has good defense gives you air body. I'm kind of shocked by how completely little look like little point there's been to Frederick even being here. Yeah, he's he's done nothing. We how long has it been since we had a flashback to him dying in Paris? Like um, ten hours. I mean, we've had the yeah, Mount Rock. We've had the. Um, the, the like slideshows, but they seem like more of a formality than anything like, at this point. Like the closest thing is way back, like two chapters ago, we had the thing on the boat where it was like, "Oh yeah, you're my sister's age when she died." Yeah, that was it. Let's fight these birds. See what they're. I'm all interested about. now in maybe someone in the thread can do some digging and find this out, or maybe we can afterwards. But if the plot, like the the Chopin stuff, was added in later, it's your go. Oh yeah, sure. Fuck! You are just fucking garbage. Yeah, probably. Um, if the Chopin stuff was added in later, like as a like a, like a, oh we need to add some more depth to this, or if this was like some director's dream of telling the story. How of is this dude still alive? The famous French composer. Oh, oh, when they're in the shadow, they're like a different dude, and I guess they have more health. What do you think? 
Oh, we no, I th it must have been part of the thing from the beginning, right? Yeah. It must have been. Was it some guy's dream? To, like, tell a story about a composer and anime babes? Or, I... like... I want to know the, the through line to this, to the development of this game. I'm sorry, I missed half of what you were saying because I was talking about game mechanics. Yeah, you just completely ignored me. No, because you see the birds, when they're in shadow, they're a different kind of bird and they have more health. And you ignored me to point that out? Yeah, because I just found it and I thought, oh, so that's why he's not dead yet, even though Jazz spent an entire turn pounding him, pounding him into mulch. They make very bubbly noises when they get hit. Yeah. God. At this point, the viewers probably learned how to tune me out as well, so... <laughs> Don't be so down on yourself. <laughs> like, you're, you're, you're half this LP. They heard the, uh, they heard the Ebony Wand joke and were like, fuck this guy. <laughs> These guys have... They, do they have horns? Or, like, no, oh, they, oh, they have horns and a huge ass stick. Lance. Lance, that's it. Yeah. I call everything a stick, because I think it's funny. So, like, when they're in the shadow, they're, like, red, and they have much more HP. Oh, god damn it! So, are they purposefully spawning beat behind a rock now? So they can't shoot anything? Well, it's, like, the third character they do that to. Yeah. See, look, they have way more health. This dude's still alive. Maybe they're just stronger enemies. No, because like when they go into the into the light, they become like the the gray birds, and, oh, yeah. and and falsetto can kill those guys in one round. Mm. Maybe they're slightly resistant to jazz is damage type or something. No, because he does a buttload of damage. Yeah. We don't need more levels, do we? No, no more. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's just go. Yeah. Hello, goodbye. Hmm. This is the main area, so this is presumably presumably quite large. It is. I'm still trying to figure out the mystery of how this game was made. Well, but Cry Crescendo, they're like, let's make a game about music. And one of them was like, I like Frederick Francois Chopin. They were like, right, Fre Freddy Chopin, we'll make a game about him. I think someone said, wouldn't it be great if it was all a dream? And someone said, no, what if it was a guy's dying dream and he died into the dream? Hmm. Oh. oh, now we get the story about Tanner. Yeah. Like, the, the, the guy the item merchant was talking about, it was foreshadowing. We'll finally learn what the hell was going on there. Yeah. All those minutes ago. Oh, so this is like this is like a Zack Faircloud strife kind of situation. <gasps> Except he doesn't, like, take his friend's identity afterwards. Spoilers! Well, I haven't played Final Fantasy VII, alright? I didn't get that far. I just got to the to the Hyrule Fields. Like, this is li that's literally the entire plot of Crisis Core, is how Zack died. Well, now I spoil Crisis Core as well. You're spoiling all of my future favorite games. <laughs> God. But I bet some musicians. There's a guy called Bass as well, but he's just. He's they should get, like, either. the London Symphony Orchestra to compose a piece that's all about the director of this game's dying dream, and he dreams he's going to a land based on video games. What's, well, like, so, like, in his. Like, everyone just unrelated people are named, like, Shigeru Miyamoto. No, like, one of the char like the, the main characters, Satoru Iwata, in, like, a hat and coat. And he goes around fighting Marios or something. On Mario Island or something. This is becoming way too complicated for my taste. Yeah, yeah, it's gotta be complicated. It's a dream, it's, ooh, it's edgy. It's like David Lynch made it. It's complicated, so it must be smart. That's a joke, I think David Lynch is a genius. Just basic attacks. Just, yep. Yeah. Jazz is just, like we're not even fight. We're like acquired no name. Great. Maybe, maybe they forgot. Maybe this is like a missing no thing. They forgot to fill it in. Maybe it's Soul Calibur. Oh, it's just more da more Daka. Does not exist. <laughs> okay, then it's not gonna change the model, so I don't really give a shit. Behind you, thank you. <laughs> Behind you, yeah. Just uh, just ignore us, please. I like that those enemies are slowly getting larger and larger weapons, and now they're just ridiculous. Yeah. Oh, do you think we could jump down there? Oh yeah, this level. It's like a maze. No. Nope. This is a secondary mine shaft, so let's just get out of here. It's yeah. pointless. This, no, this is a tertiary area, so this is even less important. How did you say that? Tertiary. It's tertiary. 
Oh, well. Tissue. Second lang English, second language. Yeah. Well, oh, he's gonna, he's, oh, Scorpio, yeah, he's gonna play with us. Aloof fiddle. So play something aloof. Listen, I found this on a tree. <laughs> it's kind of weird, but maybe you'll dig it. It was covered in piss. <laughs> How's that, huh? Well, fuck you too, buddy. Let's, try, let's just try one more. I'm getting less and less into these, like, duets. Because there's, like, we've got, like, 12 songs now. Yeah, and I can't, like, I'm not good at music, so let's just... It was more fun than when there was three. We could play all three and have a laugh. Yeah. Now it's just, like, a fucking crapshoot. I'll do do one more. Do you want to do this one or so, or another one? Play the sea shanty. I want, I want to do this one, then sea shanty all afterwards, right, cool. okay? Yeah. I just yes. like the sea shanty midi. That last note didn't line up, so this is going to be an F as well. Yep. See, Shanty? Yeah. Just, just to, like, fuck with him. Yeah. Just to spit in his face, because he what? sucks. What the fuck was that? What were you trying to do? And then just walk away. Yeah. Just leave him in the dirt. Yeah, see, Shanty, bitch. Just piss all over his song. Just... Literally. Like, Paul can come here. I got another thing for you to piss on. Oh, God. No. You started that. That's on you. It's different. A tree is like a, an intimate and private setting. People are not to be pissed. Oh, at. you can't get to the treasure chest. This was literally just to get to this asshole. Yeah. What <laughs> a dick. You walk in a huge... You know, say what you want about Dark Souls, but when you go on a long, circuitous, off-the-beaten-path trip, you don't just reach a guy who says, Fuck you, play me a song. <laughs> You know, you find a chest. You find a guy who says fuck you and then kills you and then you have to go back to him ten times. Or you open the chest and it eats you and you die instantly. Yeah. I mean, that does actually happen in these games. Oh. <laughs> no, it was well. a wall. You couldn't do that. Yep. No, you gotta you gotta fight you gotta fuck up this bird. That I'm was sorry. that was ankle high grass, man. You can't walk on that shit. Could be monsters in there, or you could trip, fall off. You gotta be safe. That's health and safety shit, man. Yeah. Oh, where am I? Oh, you're next to the bird that has, like, unreasonable amounts of hit points. I'll walk away then. Now he'll come get me. Meh, <laughs> meh. I'm so sad to be alive. Oh yeah, geez, you're right. Okay. That is a little crazy. Meh, <laughs> Nice. Yeah. Or you just get him into the light and he dies instantly. You were correct, though, before. The numbers have slowly but surely become just a mess of digits. Yeah. <laughs> it's just like, what do you even say at this point? It, it happened so gradually that I've just... I didn't notice when it became ridiculous. Mm. Probably around the time that Jazz joined us, to be mm. fair, but... You had a chance, then. I'm gonna go to this guy instead, because yeah. I can kill him in one turn. Lead the other bird out of the uh, out of the darkness. Yeah. yeah, there we go. That's like an easy hundred thousand. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck you, baby. So I get health you, when yeah, I do it too. Yeah, because that's the the weapon that he got that yeah. I told you about is like ten percent of the damage you do comes back to you as health. That's sweet. Okay, Beat's now the new main character. Give me all of your trains. See, see, and then he turns into the other bird. Yeah. And then... Oh, no, surprise, you're dead. Then this one, he just dies instantly, yeah. Okay, right. Yeah, and he also gets health every time his turn starts. Good God. Jesus Christ, that's like all my health back. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna take... No, because we can't do that, because Jazz needs both of his things. Oh, yeah. To be, like, an unstoppable death machine. We might have a spell. No, because, like, he... There's only two accessories I, I think a different party member had one. Um, we, and we... Oh. Full set has it. Well, see, so these recovery gloves, you know what you can have instead? You can have the bubbly hat. What? No, give me give me the power ring. No, because, like, there's one on here and one on here. Well, you give, take it off the set she doesn't need it. No, she, she's, the, she's one of the ones who actually does damage. <sighs> he doesn't do damage because he doesn't have power ring. Give me that, I'm the healing one, and then he'll become a monster. Of just 
Oh, yeah, look, this, like, this is more like chest protecting monsters, but he doesn't. They accidentally didn't put a thing there, so you, yeah. you can just walk past him. Yeah, will you open the goddamn chest, please? Oh, <laughs> and then I walk into him. Because <laughs> I'm great at this video game, good god. Did you take off my thing that heals me every turn? Yeah, I gave oh. it to Falsetto. Oh, yeah. But Beat is the healer, so him healing all the time is good. Yeah, but he you still have to you heal himself. You still get hit points back every time you like hit an enemy. I guess, yeah, it, it evens out. Mm. I just want him to have infinite health. The thing about it is the beat isn't actually that good. Like he takes photos. He's like the money maker. Yeah. Oh god, the sounds so terrible. That's the reason why Jazz has the weapons and armor he has. Because you know? like he's like for he's eight years old. It sounds so bad when I call him the money maker, but. Because the sounds they make are just incredible. I'm so sad every time I hear that voice. That's why I want you to fight them less. Just mm. these things don't have to die. They're not evil. They're monsters. Like I, I'm just. They, I'm these not, are just the indigenous creatures of the area. I'm not even going for the monsters because at this point the fighting isn't actually very interesting. These guys are just upset that their 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 home is being mined. How like, could you? I, we opened the goddamn chest, Allegretto. Jesus Christ! Is it windy there? Yeah. yeah. All right. So I'm gonna go. You have um, to be blown into it. A distance okay. away. There we, there we go. go. Antelope armor. I think that's for Jazz. Yeah. It's a terrible name. Antita armor. It's gonna be proboscis on it. Slightly less... Yeah, you know what? It's two points of attack. Yeah. yeah. It'll do. And then... Items. Give him, give him some of the, these fucking useless peach cookies. Just get rid of these. <laughs> he has 14,000 hit points. My god, when did that happen? Alright. Against the winner with it. Is that just a JPEG of a forest? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah, yeah. We, we ran out of our assets, Gary. We're gonna have to just... No, it's a JPEG of, like, a mountainous region, but these mountains have grass on them, and, and the ones we're on don't. Alright, guys, we're just gonna replace the final few JPEGs with some actual images. No! Why are you not affected by the wind? We're just gonna replace these our assets, and then we're gonna... Wait, you shipped it? Uh, <laughs> oh, fuck. I already made that joke, I think, sometimes. I make it all the time. It's I think this joke. was the actual intended way to go, so... I think so, yeah. Why are there all these enemies when fighting even, like, a fraction of them just makes you stupid overpowered? Because it's a JRPG. Yeah, but normally, like, the joke about them is that you have to, like, grind and grind and grind. Here, we're actively avoiding fights, and we're still just creaming every enemy that we come across. When you save, go back and look at those things. What things? Uh, the, the weird things on the side of the mountain. Like, the flower things. Oh, right. I want to see what they are in more detail. I want to see. All right. What? Go, go, go. There, like, there are plants of some of some like description. Move in. Does Allegretto have anything to say? No, they're just weird plants. Yeah, they're just weird plants. Oh yeah, there was all that stuff about the plants early on. God, I forgot how many different wastes of time were in this game. <laughs> like the the intro was all about how pretty the flowers were. Oh yeah, remember that? Oh god, I forgot all about the ten minute intro with all the voiceover. God. Yeah. It feels so long ago. And it, it was, was the so slowest ago. goddamn thing I've ever witnessed. <laughs> Speaking of slow, like this it's is taking, a, it's taking its time. Oh, There's we we no cut them. So this is where we tell them, please don't be idiots. Walt is a dickhead, and he will just murder you and invade and like invade Baroque. Yeah, I bet there's a lot of travelers in pure white coats that are like pristine, traveling over Mount Rock, where Forte's industrial mining operations happen. We could have at least... They, they could have at least brought some guards with them, just to not be murdered by bandits. Like, they're like, oh, we better not reveal who you are, and they're like, you... Everyone can tell from a million miles away that you are just incredibly rich. Do you want the last black bear? No. I mean, I'll eat it then. No, never. I'm never reading anything ever again. Like, this is the last one. No, there, there, are, there will always be more. Until, until the seas boil, there will always be more black bears. Well, yeah, we could go buy some more tomorrow. Exactly. Well, we could, in theory. That's not a good idea. If I turn myself directly over to Waltz, I'll make him understand that I am serious. We, or we could just murder him. You just die in vain. Waltz is Thank you. Pathetic. Jazz, the voice of reason, and the emperor of my heart. If I were to speak with him, I believe he could spare the prince. He's not gonna. Even if I sacrifice my own life in the process. 
Like, okay. How? How would that work? Like, okay, he, he's like, okay, I guess I'll murder you and spare him, sister. That makes sense. But would he even need to invade at that point? Like, well, God, these people are idiots. Why yeah, was, right? Why was Viola, like, in the center of the shot and just did nothing but stand there and pout? Because she's like, well, what is there to say? Someone is as big an, as it, an idiot as this. Nothing you say is going to, like, sway them. The developers would like to remind you that seven people are watching this fucking conversation. Mm. Oh shit. Well, it's not gonna be a boss fight, because there's like 14 of them. Oh, it's a bigger version of the baby dragon we killed earlier. Oh shit, is that Forte's forces? But uh, what does that mean they're invading? This is their mountain. They're like... attacking us. Oh fuck! Oh shit! What? So many... Did Waltz come personally to try and kill us? How did he know we were here? What is happening? No, but like... Cause oh, why would... Stand by in the skies oh shit, we get to fuck up his dragon. It's like Final Fantasy IX, right? Where you kill the, like, silver dragon? Yeah, those dragons are red, so you can tell they're they're different. We saved it even yeah. if we had battle yeah, that size, we'd have no chance of defeating them. And after they killed us... Dude, you're like Heat Wave Master. That's just... Jeez, what... Heat wave. <laughs> and while while I do that, Beat's gonna go off to the side, build off some echoes on the dragons in the sky, and then fucking thirty-two echo heat wave. Bam! I'll, everyone's I'll, dead. I'll harmony chain him to bitch death hell. <laughs> to bitch death hell. <laughs> it's the title of my new album. I'm free basing it. Okay, I'm just making these j words up as I go along. Mm. Speaking of bass, that guy was mentioned, but we never saw them. It would have been terribly rude of me to make you come all the way to Forte. <laughs> so I thought I'd come to meet you halfway. That rhymes. Sort of. It's a music game. Mm -hmm. Eventually we're going to get driving. Couplets in it. Mm -hmm. Let's do some haiku next. So are we going to finally get to see... As leader of Baroque, I no, you fucking... Look, he's... Ki let's he's hear him out. Let's he's hear on him. a fucking dragon. Let's he's just going to burn you to a crisp. It makes sense anymore. to surrender then. Come on. You seem to be a noble prince who cares about his subjects. What a fucking idiot. However, mm. I'm afraid I cannot give you a response without some kind of guarantee. We kind of have you over a barrel, though, so... That mm. I am standing here in front of you is proof of my word. I am turning myself over the to... The evil McMustache man is not going to take that. Look, they're going to, like, murder and the girl, exchange, right? I ask that you not harm in any way Serenade. He's gonna murder his own sister just to prove how evil he is. Nah, no, I'm just gonna snap a neck right in front of you. Mm. Capturing me should satisfy is the prince gonna- is the king gonna be on our party now? Or, or Serenade? He's a prince because the king is ill and oh, yeah. is being treated with mineral powder. No floral powder. Is that true? Is that what's happening? The, that was what they, they said. Oh shit. To make sure that Baroque made no move. That they never invaded Forte. I carefully monitored everything there to make sure they never... In fact, I, I personally made them not come murder your ass, so maybe be a bit thankful for that. that by doing this, I was choosing to give Why would you support, like, this idiot man-child ass? She wasn't really supporting that she was trying to prevent a war. Mm. She, it's, she's a conflicted woman. Right. Right, I guess. It's just... Everything is happening so slowly. I was mistaken Empires are colliding, man. Does it, does, does, Rome wasn't destroyed in a day. Although it technically was. But by just staying in the same place, none of the problems we face can ever be resolved. Do you think there's it's like... Do you yeah. think there's a grant, like, mo some kind of grant money to research the children outstretched t pose arm disease? I'm pretty sure there's grant money for the most pretentious anime game every year. Yes, that is correct. The fact that we are standing I don't understand here any character's idle animation in this game. How is that proof of anything? Like, you didn't know they were gonna come here? You might as well have been on your way to assassinate them. Look, if you deconstruct every sentence they say, nothing will make sense. You've gotta roll with it. Come on, you've gotta get into the swing of this petty bullshit game. 
then Count Waltz presses a button and the ground crumbles under them. Oh, it's too bad you don't have dragons. Well, see you later. <laughs> if we fight Count Waltz now, he's not gonna die. But if if he did, hmm? that means we've got like two whole chapters of just crazy. Because what would happen then? I don't know. The game would actually start. I can't wait to skip this cutscene next time we do the fight. <laughs> oh, goodness. I'm just betting there's a fight here. Yeah, but there's going to be a fight. Because we got all the mineral powder. Also, we also dragons. <gasps> I told How you. dare you say that about Jimmy? Like, anyone can see this coming from a fucking mile. Oh, oh, Polka, right, because he wants the, the glowing of go-go's. Who is he pointing to? Polka. Obviously. Oh, it's salsa. Wait, what? This is a surprise. What? So if you turn that girl over to us, I will guarantee the safety of Prince Crescendo and Serenade. Nah. And of course, we promise to treat the young lady. This is interesting because the, the the king probably will won't give over an innocent person who has no standing in this. Again? You never met this guy. She complained to him before. And, and oh, him right. oh, right, yeah. Only the best of I'll kill myself! <laughs> oh, that's where she jumps off the cliff again. Sure the so no one can steal going a go-go's. Yeah. We don't, we've no, like, we don't even know what the Agogos are, they're just like lens flare effects. I think the prince made a huge ass mistake arriving next to all of these warriors in person. He could have sent someone down to say this. No, but he's like evil. Stab him in the he's neck. He's like evil beyond all logic and reason. That makes sense. That's actually fair. Now you're getting into it, you see? Yeah, now, now you're acting on its level, you know? Jump off the cliff. Don't walk into my arm. No one's ever said... I have a rash there and it hurts. No one's ever <laughs> said Polka with such Don't fierceness before. I'm sure nothing bad will happen. She's lying to make him feel better. She knows she's fucked. It's, yeah. Her life's just going to be terrible. Even she is not this stupid. I've just realized that the female characters have eyelashes and the male characters don't. That's some detail. Well, that's happen that, like, that happens in every like piece of media. Because every female has to be like aggressively feminine, even even if the like falsetto, they're sort of boyish. They still have to have eyelashes because girls just have that. I mean, they kind of do. Look, I have eyelashes. No, you don't. That's a lie. You made that up. I mean, it's not like like is the implication that Polka has been like applying makeup every morning while they've been traveling and stuff? That's just how women look in Anime Land. Yeah. Oh whatever. well. Oh, I thought there was going to be a fight, but I guess not. Well, he's dead now. Did it like bite his head off? No. No. Calm down, young man. Try to refrain from doing. Stab him! Stab him in the neck! Do it! It's all a trick. Or do you Kill him! Slit him up! Away this historic piece that has finally do sunblast, whatever it's called. Sunslash. Sunslash. This is, this is very emotional. I'm sad. I just gave her a better umbrella. If she's just gonna leave. We should have taken the umbrella by the tree. Yeah. The cello tree. Well, she's, she can't live that. She's 14 years old. Oh, there's polka dots on one of her legs. That's where her name comes from. That, those aren't polka dots. Those are like cord things, aren't they? Cord hole. Yeah. It's confirmed, my lord. What? Glowing a go-go's. But we still don't... Why do we have a stake in the Agogos? Mineral powder efficiency. Yeah, 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 but like the Agogos themselves, why do we care about them? Uh, mineral powder efficiency. Capitalism. Yeah, 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 I get the mineral powder. Why do we care about the Agogos? Like, why do we care about protecting them and making them not into they mineral get, powder? Because mineral powder's bad. And also the Agogos die in the process like they just did. You just mm. kill that, you just kill that little cube yeah. thing. That, that lens flare is dead now. It's glowing. That doesn't mean it's more effective. It's just, that just means it's glowing. Apparently, it is more effective, though. You know. He doesn't know that. He just knows it's glowing now. It's it's all purple. <laughs> oh my God! Why would you do that? That's it's the knockout slap. They do it in every game. Mm. Make it to women. Legato. Even in fucking Legato. Zelda, they do it. Like, like, what was the point of that? Other than just to be a, a an asshole and make everyone hate you. <laughs> Headbutt him in the face. If she had agreed to come with you, everything was fine. Take his hat off and choke him. Oh, now, now we get to murder him. Play 
with you for a little amusement. We don't get well. We're not gonna get what? to murder him. But shh, it's, if he's actually a difficult boss, I'm gonna be pissed. When did he have time to train? Is that a keyblade? <laughs> Sweet. This oh. is what we wanted, isn't it? To assassinate the, the king. The he's count. not gonna be difficult, but his dragon is gonna be like a bitch. Oh shit! We have to fight the dragon too. I'm gonna murder the dragon first. All right. Good plan. Let's build up some meter. All right. Oh, you I pressed it. I actually pressed it. Mm. I know for a fact that I pressed it. I could take a picture, but I want to be away from the dead mm. man first. Yeah, let's Away just... from the dragon. Slit him up. Nice. Oh, uh, that, that, that. No. Oh, fuck. Oh, he blocked that one. Oh. Wow. Jesus, shit. Nice. This is probably a good a good team arrangement. Oh boop. He's down. Poke him. Oh no. Oh. Oh, Jesus Christ. Fuck me. Oh, it was me. Getting my health back up. Let's just murder the dragon first. Yeah, the dragon's gone. That's Sweet, fine. he exploded. You might want to heal. Oh, heat blade. Oh fuck, he's down, isn't he? Yeah. Should I should I revive or no um, heal or heal heal? Oh okay. Yeah! Picture the king! Yeah, that Ca Count! Right. Whatever, fuck him. He's gonna die now. We probably should have equipped more clovers. Yeah. Oh, well. oh fuck! Well, I'm, I'm dead, because I tried to block. Yep, Jazz is dead. Nice. On the edge of my seat! Oh, I could have countered it, shit. Don't worry about it. It's never worth hovering over the counter button. I'll revive Jazz. Oh, oh no! Oh, you fucker. Goddess Bouquet, do it. Have fun. I'm actually gonna run away for a bit, just so we have like people spread out. So they attacks Jazz, the glass cannon. Oh wait, he'd attack Jazz anyway, wouldn't he? Oh. Well, we have no more items. As long as Jazz lives through this. We can get big hits on him. Yeah. Don't use meter with her. Build it up for Jazz. Get behind him. Good plan. Sweet. Oh. Oh no, he's behind Jazz. I can't turn around. Yeah, we're using it because Snowcall builds up so much. Yeah, yeah. Might as well. Yeah, yes! we got him. So close. Wow. Fucking own, bitch. We got a Jokel Snort. Yeah. And a demonic mask because he was a demon. That's my, that's my, that's my favorite kind of knot. <laughs> <laughs> I prefer the Dreadnought. Oh, she got a move called Phoenix Rising. What? It, I bet you that's going to revive. Maybe? I don't know. That one seems a bit OP. Why would she get that? I mean, she's not a healer. Well, we have we have people we have moves that he. Oh, yeah. We're, we're party level. Yes. What does this do? Let's check. Uh, tactical time is now at zero. We can do three harmony chains. 
Yeah. Holy shit. Special attacks can now be used in counter- Special attacks can be used in counter attacks. Movement is now... We, mo we move faster. Yeah, up to three special attacks. If there are allies within attack range, item slots are increased to 40. This is good. So basically, we can now swarm people with dudes and use all their attacks at once. Yeah, but we still need 24 echoes to do chains. Um, and and we now have zero tactical time. Sweet, bring it on. So we have to make real sure that we look out for who's next. Let's see if this actually kills him or not. Like I hope that. it does. Oh. Looks like the old guy's the only one... He's dead! Shit, he's just gone! Well, we murdered him! It's weird how... Like... It's weird how... Can I, can I finish? Yeah. It's weird how in... The fight he just falls oh, down, but he's just gone in the yeah. actual... Oh off. shit, he's gonna eat the mineral power. Oh no! It's poison, isn't it? It's gonna be poison, because that's what the... Yeah, that that looks poisonous. It looks bad. Is that how you use a go to mineral powder? You just shove them in there? You drink them, yeah. You push, push no, them but like, you oh, just... Yeah. A yeah, they melt immediately in contact. Yeah, now he instantly becomes a plague doctor. But a big plague doctor! Is this a two-tier boss fight? Well, I hope not. We've got no more items. He doesn't seem too happy. What the? What's happening? Oh, that was a good tween. Oh, <laughs> shit. I, I hope... He, I think he accidentally stepped into a shadow. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, right, that's what happened. Well, I'm, get, I'm hoping that what happens now is that the characters run away. And then we get to save and fight him. Yeah. No, but we just save maybe? Because I don't this doesn't look like it's gonna end well. Alright. Well, at least you know like you know, look at the bright side of things. Glowing a go go mass production into mineral powder is not happening now. Cause Waltz is dead and this guy is Oh shit, we are fighting him? No well, that was an interesting chapter. Now it's gonna flash forward, right? And then flash back to the fight later, or something. Maybe. Oh. oh shit, yeah. He disappeared. He faded to white. He's gone now. Hey, is everyone okay? Is this gonna be like, well, with Chopin's piano performance, like, oh, that was a great fight we just had. Oh, I sure, sure hope no one missed it who wanted to see it. No, oh, he just did disappear. He became such a big dragon that he just exploded. Oh shit. Oh wow. Fucking told you. Fucking who called it? This is a bit more. H bomber guy, right here. This is a bit more than just a tenfold increase in potency. Weird shit, weird shit started happening. All up on me. Somehow? You all owe me a new avatar and the thread or something. All of them? You can only have all one at a time. You all have to buy me one. Well, let's let's look at our cheap. Oh, it's just going to be new part, new party level, new, 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 chapter. new chapter. Yeah. Is there a save point here? Can we save before we go into the hell portal? Yeah. Legato is his name, the old how guy. How do they know about this? How do they know what's happening here? Well, they saw it. Yeah, but how do they know this world is in danger or something? Well, well if, I guess because he's a big dragon. If you saw a dude morph into something like that and then create a big wormhole... That's true, I guess. Do you want to... Maybe Let's let's leave. Let's just... This is none of let's our business. We're just going to go. Fuck. No, okay. I guess we got to go after the big fuck off dragon. Is he going to be the final boss? Just the old mustache guy? That would be a fucking cool twist, wouldn't it? Oh, it's just the mustache man. Well... Let's do it! Well, maybe there's... We can go back to the save point. And uh, well, let's have a look around, just in case, yeah. Yeah, we'll go, go back to the save point point, save our game. I'm glad that you, like me, have save point sense, where you're like, I'm gonna go save. Oh, you can. Thank God. Yeah. Alright. In that case, we should probably take a break, and then dive into the portal next time. On chapter 7, out of... Well, we looked ahead, so chapter 7 out, out of... Eight. Out of chapter 7 and the final chapter. Of Eternal Sonata. Looks like it's not that eternal anymore. 19 hour, holy fucking. Ah, oh, God. Do you think anyone's gonna watch this? Do you think anyone's gonna like watch all these videos? Um, some fucking weirdos, probably. Do a fake laugh. I'm just kidding, we love uh. you. Please support us by the official Instant Bombapalooza merchandise. Thank you for watching this, Clavius. Fave, <laughs> fave us on, on Patreon. And subscribe to us on UART and PoopTube. And uh, subscribe to me on Tinder. Wait, that's a real site. Okay, hold on. That's how that works, right? Uh, 